I'm Nigel from Motor Tackling Outdoors. I'm going to show you the gear and the techniques on how to catch brim on cranker crabs. So the rod I'm using is a Daiwa TD Sole. That's a seven foot. That's a two to five kilo rod. So I like to use the seven foot rods for a good cast distance. Also the soft tips that prevents pulling hooks on the, on the fish. So the reel I'm using is the Daiwa Freems LT in a 2500. I prefer the 2500 because it's just well balanced with the rod as well as I can get better cast distance on a, on a slightly larger reel. So the line I'm using is a J Bay Grand in an eight pound and the leader is a six pound Sunline FC Rock fluorocarbon that I run about two rod lengths approximately. I like to connect my braid to leader with an FG knot. I tie my fluorocarbon leader just directly to the split ring on the cranker crab. The key features with the cranker crab that make it so successful for brim are the floating claws which have the hooks attached. So as the claws float, the brim will come in and take the claws and, and get hooked up. Uh, the weight underneath the belly of the crab just helps the crab to sink very naturally in the water, just like it's been washed off a bridge pole or a rock wall. The crab also has very lifelike soft legs which can be replaced if they do happen to get pulled out by a brim grabbing it and tearing them out. The technique is uh, relatively simple, it's basically casting in close to structure where the brim may be holding and pretty much let the lure waft its way down with the current. Uh, they'll often eat it on the drop, if not on the bottom. You can just give the bait a little bit of a jiggle just to get the fish's attention. And then instead of striking, just winding the fish on, letting the rod do the work to set the hooks. The areas I like to fish the crabs is around bridge poles, the rock walls or steep ledges. When using these baits, you can pretty much use them all year round. It really doesn't matter what season. Summertime, they're actively feeding and warm and they'll chase them down and hunt them winter time. Uh, their fish can be sitting on the bottom spawning and this is a great presentation to catch them. So I'm using the 50 mil crab. They come in two weights, the heavy and the light. I prefer to use the heavy as I can get down the current as well as I can get some cast distance in these windy days. So I like to use the Procure Blue Crab scent. Uh, it just more than anything gives me confidence in knowing that it smells and looks just like a real crab. So basically guys, yeah, just come down to your local, find a rock wall, a bit of current on it, and uh, throw a crab out and give it a go.